Now, Molly Rainford, wow, who just all last year. Do you remember? She made it to the Strictly final before landing her dream role in EastEnders. And it's been a dramatic start to life in Walford for Anna Knight. Well, Molly joins me now. It's so good to see you. And you. Really good to see you. What an impact you've made already. Cindy Beale, of course, coming back. That was a big deal, wasn't it? I know. It was such a big Huge. deal. Huge. I mean, I didn't find out till the week she was there as well. <laughs> it was amazing. It was amazing. And, like, to have someone so iconic as your mother. Very good. Indeed. <laughs> I, I couldn't agree more. Absolutely. You're loving it, aren't you? This is the dream job for it's you. It's amazing, especially being from the East End. Like, yeah. it's, pretty, it's pretty cool for all my family as well. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's just been, it's been mad. It's so, it's so different to any job I've done, you know. You kind of know what's going to happen to your character at the end of something, yes. usually. Yes. But this is just like, I don't know what's happened to her next week. No, you don't, <laughs> and it's open-ended, so you never know what's going to happen. Exactly. That's the thing. And you can go in so many different directions. Obviously, there's the love triangle. Indeed. Going on. Indeed. All of that. We shall find out how that goes. Um, mm -hmm. Can we talk strictly? Because obviously you were a finalist last year. Yeah. Um, it's fascinating because you know you want to win the glitter ball, but you got a better present than I that. Did. You got the best prize in the world. I did. I did. I got the best boy ever. You honestly. got our Tyler. I know. Aww. I know. You guys are so lucky to have him <laughs> as well. No, honestly, like it was so lovely because we just became really, really great friends on the show. I think just having that support from each other and like our families got on really well in the audience and all that good stuff and then when we started dating it was like oh you've all met so it's all right i know it's good <laughs> it's like the strictly anti-curse because you two found each other i know do you, do you still dance look i'm seeing you there dancing do you we love it honestly like I mean, every look. time we go out with our friends we, we do look, like to do a little bit of salsa you know oh, but it's not fair on the rest of your pals i know would you teach them you're too good <laughs> you're too good now look obviously you work with bobby brazier on east Enders. of course you do Indeed. and he's in strictly but your heart is in another place. It is. It I mean, obviously, be. I've got to support the cast mates, but... Of course. I'm team goo forever now. Well, of course you are. I am. Because you danced with them. I know. I kind of feel like his partner is my partner. Is it weird seeing... going to be weird seeing him dance with somebody else, seeing Carlos dancing with someone else? It is, it is, but I'm so excited, actually. I can't wait to see what they do together. <laughs> Oh, it's great. Look, 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 look. Just good, good, good memories. Good I know, memories. I know. I couldn't have had the, a better time. I always say I'd love to do it every year. Yeah. And like you said, I got to meet my Tyler out of it. So I'm a very lucky girl. It's wonderful. It is. Now, look, this is not the first time you sat there. Mm -hmm. Because we spoke, <laughs> didn't we? It was quite some time ago. Was quite it about some time ago. 11 years ago or something 11 like years. That? Can we have a little look? <laughs> 11 years ago, because you're a contemporary... Well, you're a finalist Again? on Britain's Got Talent. Yeah. Yeah, so let's have a look. <laughs> and you really wanted to, to do this, didn't you? Yeah, like, you... I was watching the show and I said to my mum one day, I think I can do that. Everyone's been really supportive. They're all really excited for me. I bet they are. I sound so Essex. You do. <laughs> Well, that's great. That's, that's great. Yeah. But what an experience that was as a kid of 11 to do that. Uh, who beat you that year? Was it Ashley? It was Ashley and Pudsey. Ashley and Pudsey. Listen, there was no way that they I'm were going to win. I'm not beating a dog. No. Everyone it, loves it, a dog. It, it, the dog is going <laughs> to win. You may, they might as well have given it to you. And just not bothered. Do you know? And just says, Ashley and Pudsey, there you go. You know, yeah. But an amazing thing to do at that age. I loved it. Again, like, I've always wanted to sing since I was, you know, way younger than that. And to get the opportunity to do it. And also, the doors that it opened after. Like, yeah. I, I might, might not be sitting here now if it weren't for that show. Yeah. So I'm, I'm so, like, blessed that I got the opportunity to do that. So you went on place. to do, you did kids shows, you know, you did Nova Jones. All Nova that. Jones, yeah. You did all of these things that are going on, which is absolutely brilliant. And you've just kind of... On and on and on and on, which is great. Now, talking about that you're a great singer, new single out. Yes. As if you've not got enough going on. <laughs> Dancing with Tyler yeah, and know. doing these standards. You've got a single out as well. I do. My heart's a broken record. Um, and, yeah, I did it with a, a lovely friend of mine called Alex. And turns out, we got introduced, right? Then it turns out we're next door neighbours. No. Yes. That's mad. Literally lives like three minutes away. Fantastic. But, yeah. Well, that's handy. It is very handy. Can we have a wee listen? Of course I think we, we can. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> it's beautiful. To believe in a miracle that just slipped through my hands. Well, could you take a chance on me? Can you forgive it all? To believe in a miracle. Yeah, I put you through hell, but I'm asking you to believe. I love that.
love singing on the stairs. Yes, yeah, singing on the stairs is good. And that was Alex behind you on the guitar. That was Alex behind me. I mean, you have a voice like an angel. Oh, you are the triple you. threat because you, <laughs> you act and you sing and, of course, you dance. Well, I can learn to dance, OK? <laughs> but I wouldn't say I can dance. Well, you can. <laughs> you absolutely can. Obviously, EastEnders for now. But you've got so much energy and so much passion in what you do. There's going to be more music coming, I would have yes, thought. Yes, yeah, for sure. I'm, I'm so excited for what's to come. And I, and I love collaborating. I think that's such a yeah. way to do it at the moment, especially with the busy schedule. It's nice to do it with someone else and sure. supporting me. And, no, definitely. And I'll be round to Alex's house to do another one, I'm sure, because he's only around the corner. He's only so down the right. corner. Yeah. It just works out. He's on the corner. You can be on the stairs. Yes. Can Tyler sing? Do you know what? He's got some vocals. Has he? Yeah, I always hear him in the shower and I'm like, Ty, we need to get you on a track. I think this may happen. <laughs> it's so lovely to talk to you. I feel as if we are related, because you know I have adopted Tyler. Indeed. He's indeed. got two mummies now. Two mummies. Deb's <laughs> so we're kind of related, so that's quite good. I love that. <laughs> it's good. Does that mean you're my mother-in-law? Yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Absolutely. <laughs> I, I, I embrace, embrace that. <laughs> East Enders, obviously, tonight, half past seven. Yes. BBC One. So good to see you. Angie, thank you so much for having me. And good luck with the single. Thank it's lovely, you. beautiful. Thank, thank you. you.